OK, now that we've looked at our loop devices, our panel I.O., our expansion I.O., our serial enunciator, and our dialer, let's take a look at our panel settings. If we right click on our panel and select Edit Settings, this brings up the Configure Panel Settings box. The first tab is the Panel Data tab. Here, we can select our panel name, our panel address, our Access Level 3 code, our Access Level 2 code, our Buzzer Silenced Access Level, our panel text. This is the text that will be displayed on the panel. Our default pattern for our NAC circuits, the number of loops. Will this be a for loop panel or a to loop panel? Our loop offset feature, which allows us to have loops from multiple panels numbered sequentially, and our general alarm mode, common or zonal. Next is the time tab. The first thing you'll see in the times tab is the panel day and night schedule, where we can set our daytime and nighttime schedule on a Sunday through Saturday calendar. Next is our sounder timeout feature, our AC fail report delay, our daily calibration time, and our alarm verification time in seconds. The last tab is the network interface tab. Network interface defines the relationship of all the nodes on the network. First, we determine how this panel will respond to event types from other nodes on the network. By default, this panel will respond to fire, emergency, and auxiliary events only from nodes 2, 3, and 4. If I want this event to respond to trouble events from nodes 2 and 3, I simply check the trouble box. Second, we determine which other nodes on the network will have authority to reset, silence, and resound this panel. With the status box checked, nodes 2, 3, and 4 will have that authority. If we expand the panels, you see that we can choose to process, display, log into our history, print if we have a serial printer, and buzz on our piezo specific event types. It's important to note, to fully define the relationship of all the nodes on the network, we'll have to configure the network interface for each of the nodes on the network independently.